Yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video today here on whiteclo.oplegends.com and today we have a lot to go over. But before we get straight into the video, I do want to go ahead and pick the giveaway winner for the last video. Okay, so the winner of last video's giveaway is the white gamer 55. So let's do slash credits or slash pay the white gamer 55 credits and 1000 credits because that is how much the giveaway was for. And with those, you could buy just stuff on the store. You can buy some pretty good stuff like ranks and there's also loot boxes and stuff that are very very helpful but yeah now let's get straight into the video so we have made a lot of progress since the last video as you can tell if we go and look we have max orb greed and max dragon burst for our like for our rebirth because as you can see when you do rebirth you do get another increase in the max amount of levels you can get we also have max scavenger and scavenger is going to help us max out efficiency and fortune over time oh and we also did get some lemonite leggings and we're also very close to getting some lemonite boots so that is very helpful and we also have 1.4 billion orbs but as you can see we really have nothing to use them on we can i guess put some explosive enchant but i think it's better off to save so when we do rebirth we can go ahead and get some more orb green and dragon burst because those are the two best enchants you want to be going for when you are starting off and also i just noticed if we take a look in slash skills we have reached the max level for our mining skill we still have these to go ahead and increase well it says we do have the max level for those so they looks like it might be adding those in the future but yeah we have the max level and we did get a look we got a sold start of the world key and auto claimed it but we did get a start of the world flare so let's go ahead to spawn in order to go ahead and open this let's just throw it down right there and let's see what rewards we can get from it this is cool animation where it drops from the sky and let's see it looks like these are the things it will probably spread out and let's see so we got a 3x money booster a 2 tier 4 modifier box 500 rank ups and some more modifier boxes and for the final reward it was 64 ultra pet boxes definitely gonna take those so let's go ahead and open up all of these pet boxes let's just open up all of them delete the beginner ones and ascend all of them hopefully we get some good pets in here so we are currently using a tier 4 dragon burst pet i think this is one of the best pets not the tier but the like dragon burst pet is probably one of the best we have these lucky block ones some scavenger ones nothing too good we have some tier 5 orb pets but i'm pretty sure dragon burst pets are probably the best ones you guys want to go ahead and get but now let's open up these modifier boxes because as you can see our current modifier is a 1.97 money so let's see we got a 2.95 money booster definitely gonna take this one uh beacons we don't need beacons because we're not currently competing for game top so let's go ahead and apply this one and that's just gonna get us more money which is eventually gonna lead to more rank ups we are currently rank 18,000, which is pretty good so we're back at this plot if you guys didn't watch the last video selling keys are a really really good way of making money and if we take a look in my pvs we have a ton of keys to sell so just keep in mind we are rank 18,500. let's go sell the 12 relic keys and that brought us up 2,000 ranks to rank 20,000, but now we have so many mine keys but they don't sell for honestly too much but let's just see yeah we only went up 200 levels but still we'll take all of the rank ups we do need because as you rank up you get even more and more money and you can use those to trade for some orbs or beacons or anything like that and we are not currently at my mind but this is one of my friend's minds and basically it's probably better to go and mine somebody mine that is a higher level because if you take a look at slash mines there's people with mine levels that are like look 91 and you get way more orbs at higher level mines so i do recommend to go ahead and mine at other mines at the start and then once you do max out your pickaxe you go back to your mine to help level that up and the reason it gives you more is just it's just, it's just so much bigger so the dragon burst enchant and all of that would just give you way more orbs i did also receive another boss this one is a little bit better i'm pretty sure it is a special boss it's called the it's a warden boss it's 40,000 health and you get six rewards i'm pretty sure i got i already fought one i'm pretty sure i got these legend mixtures from it but i'm gonna see if some people want to fight it real quick if not then we probably won't fight it because it will take a long time to actually go ahead and kill if we do it by ourselves we are almost pickaxe level 100 and once we get that that means we could go ahead and rebirth again and once we do get to rebirth too that means we're going to unlock the ballistic sheep enchant the greed enchant and the combo enchant i heard the combo enchant is a really really good enchant to actually go ahead and have we also unlock these i think these, i think we just unlock these four enchants then there's these at like higher rank higher rebirths but yeah the combo enchant i heard is really really good to actually go ahead and get so we're gonna start saving up some orbs for that because as you can see we're 15 levels away from level 100 and it won't honestly take that long i'm pretty sure it's about one level every 1000 raw blocks mined i did go over a little bit one time because i just didn't want to rebirth i wanted to rebirth in the video but yeah so we do have some extra blocks mined it's about one level every 1000 blocks mined just as a reference one thing i forget to do that i should probably do is to use boosters i honestly just don't use any of these boosters so let's equip a money booster we should have a orb booster let's just equip one of these two i'm pretty sure you use both at the same time maybe not 
No, yeah, let's see if we can. I'm pretty sure you can check your multipliers too. Our current money multiplier is a 8.7, which is all right. And our current orb multiplier is only 4.85. We definitely have to start trying to increase that for more orbs. I think honestly, my main goal is to try to get the full Lemonite set because the next set is Sapphire and we're still about 800,000 raw blocks away from that. You need a million raw blocks in order to start getting Sapphire. So that is a ways away. It's going to take us a while and Lemonite is going to help us a ton. Yeah, so it's just going to take a long time to get to the 1 million raw blocks but we can definitely do it we just need to grind a little bit more because we are kind of slacking but we did get some relics completed so let's go ahead and relics let's see so this one skeleton horse boss egg would be pretty cool what do we get we've got four ultra pet boxes we're actually going to take those two but in this one we could get a demigod seasonal rank so let's see what we got from it and 10 loot crates so not really what i wanted but yeah but the demigod seasonal rank i'll probably just give away because let's see where it is on the ranks game mode ranks it looks like this is the second rank i'm pretty sure you get mortal for free so yeah but it will still be nice to give it away to somebody who needs it on the server and a good guide when getting enchants that somebody told me is about for every 1000 dragon burst enchants you get get 500 or greed so say you have two thousand of the dragon burst enchant you should probably have about a thousand in the orb green enchant and that just makes it kind of even and evens it out because you still want to make sure you're getting more orbs and activating orb green more because you just need more orbs in order to get all of the enchants we do have a pickaxe ultimate modifier if we take a look it says it would double all our pickaxe modifiers for 40 seconds and our current one is for money it's just gonna give us a lot more money so let's activate it we should be getting a lot more money in these next few cells from our block pack and that's going to help us rank up a lot. I mean, maybe not like too much because it is getting kind of hard to rank up. But I mean, it does get easier once you do get better enchants. So that is very helpful. Getting enchants is probably your main priority on the server because that's how you get orbs, beacons, money, and just rank up a lot faster. But I'm pretty sure my main goal is trying to just rebirth because once we do that, we'll be able to unlock a lot more enchants that are going to be very, very helpful to us. The main one, as I said earlier, was the combo enchant because it just gives you a lot of boost and stuff. And I'm pretty sure it's just really helpful. A lot of people said it is really good. But we're at pickaxe level 90 now. We're about 10 levels away from getting to level 100. And as soon as we get there, we're going to be rebirthing because it is just going to be very helpful. And after rebirth you already know we're going to be putting more dragon burst and oil read on our pickaxe because that is going to help us a ton and also i don't know if i showed this last video but in the point shop you get points after rebirthing i did go ahead and get orb magician and you get a 1x orb multiplier and let's see i'm pretty sure there's some other versions there's like higher tiers in of you can get but i think you have to save up some of the points for that so we might go ahead and start saving for some higher orb magicians or maybe there might be a better one i don't really know but like if you're just a casual player like me and not playing for the top then orb magician is probably one of the better ones to go ahead and get in the point shop i am going to get the final piece for the lemonite armor in this video so that's gonna be very helpful we do also have this thing it's called a money scroll it says gain a plus it says gain a plus 0.6 money multiplier for every armor tier so i guess we just equipped it oh we can put it on any piece um i think we're gonna save it because i mean there is better armor as you can see if you take a look there's sapphire jade all of these that goes up to this one it cost 8 million raw blocks which is so much because because we're not even at a million yet so it's gonna take a long time to get there i don't even know if we're gonna be able to get there this season okay so we are about to trade for all of the lemonite that we do need we're gonna go ahead and give him three of the dragon burst boost and he's just gonna be giving me a bunch of these lemonites so let's go ahead and do that and it's in our mailbox let's go ahead and get all of those and we should be able to get the last piece which is the boots and boom now we have a full set of lemonite and this is just gonna, just gonna give us boost to beacons and money but now guys it is time to go ahead and we're going to be doing this boss and we do have somebody here to go ahead and help us and let's just go ahead and right click it it's the warden boss as you can see has 40,000 health so just we're gonna have to start mining and it's gonna take a while but we honestly should be able to get to the next rebirth when we are trying to go ahead and defeat this boss and once we go ahead and do that that's gonna be very very good because then we're gonna be able to get some more dragon burst and orb greed and other enchants so we're definitely gonna take that i have defeated this boss once before and i'm pretty sure we did get some modifiers out of it if i'm not mistaken so yeah hopefully we get some more of those maybe we could get a better one than the one we currently have or maybe we get something else we're definitely gonna take some other things because we are kind of lacking with some things in our pickaxe maybe a better um ultimate modifier might be pretty good because our current one is all right but we have to go ahead and keep on activating it which is kind of a pain because 
when you're mining you don't want to go ahead and go into the menu every every few minutes or whenever we can go ahead and use it so hopefully we get a better one but let's go ahead and activate a booster and so let's go into our pv let's go ahead and activate an orbs booster and let's just put a 2x money booster on because honestly just just why not so boom and boom now we're gonna be able to get more money and more orbs i mean we currently have a decent amount of orbs it's not like crazy amount because if we take a look in slash orbs top people have 20 bill plus which honestly is crazy but we're definitely going to be able to use these 1 billion orbs in the future as we do unlock more and more enchants so we have reached pickaxe level 100 we are still fighting the boss but let's go ahead and rebirth and let's do boom only cost 100k orbs and boom so we can't go ahead and buy this because it cost eight rebirth points and we only have six so we're gonna have to hold on on hold off on that until we get more rebirth points but yeah we did get to the second rebirth so that is pretty cool that means we can go ahead and increase the level in orb greed enchant not unlocked okay well we have to get enchant level one again or just pickaxe level one again in order to actually use that okay so now we have pickaxe level five so we can actually go ahead and get some of the enchants but they do cost a ton of orbs but it's gonna be worth this so oh this is gonna cost a lot but definitely gonna be worth it so we have these maxed out again we might go ahead how much is 100 levels only 20 mil we're gonna get scavenger to level 500 and now we have all of these three maxed out maybe not scavenger but 50 levels isn't really anything so yeah now we have a pretty good pickaxe we could put some more enchants into explosive but i just don't think it's worth it but we do have a legendary and epic relic that we're gonna go ahead and put in there we are currently doing a mythic relic right now now, if we take a look, the possible rewards are two ultra robot boxes, two uh, tier four modifier box, 10 tier four modifier boxes, which would be pretty cool. And then three free loot boxes. And if we take a look in the crate, we can see these free loot boxes can give us some good bosses. Some of these start of the world, start of the world flares, just some pretty good stuff. But I think the best thing we're probably going to be looking for is the 10 tier 4 modifier boxes because those will help us a ton. We should be getting more orbs now because the dragon burst is actually getting more blocks with the um, orb greed. So yeah, we should be getting more orbs. We're actually getting a, a lot of more orbs from the start. Our old pickaxe was getting like barely any, but now we're easily getting a million pretty fast. This boss is taking a long time to go ahead and kill. It is just me and this other guy, but we're slowly getting there. I think it's almost at halfway. Once the mine resets, I'll go ahead and check. But yeah, I'm pretty sure it's almost halfway, so we do have a lot more to go. Yeah, we're getting there because it has 40,000 health, which I'm pretty sure means 40,000 raw blocks. So that is a lot. And let's go ahead and take a look. It should be over here somewhere. Oh, it's actually almost at 15,000 health, so it is actually lower than uh, 50% or lower than half the health, so that is definitely good. We are going to continue to mine. We are going to need to kill this boss for the rewards. The thing that kind of sucks is once you do rebirth, it does require you to get back to the pickaxe level of the certain enchant in order to start using it i'm pretty sure so like if we take a look like enchants like this key finder enchant we're not currently like using because we need pickaxe level 24 so we're not currently getting any keys and that goes along with like if we're just starting out when we need pickaxe level one for orb greed and dragon burst those enchants wouldn't be happening since the pickaxe would be back to level zero we're almost at a million beacons i'm pretty sure the going rate is about 50 million orbs for 1 million beacons so that's not bad but we can hold on to our beacons for a little bit until the price goes up and get a lot more orbs that way so you think that is what we're going to do for now if you guys are wondering why i'm mining from the bottom it's just because the other guy is mining from the top and it's just kind of a mess since i don't have a high speed i think once you get a higher speed it's better to just run across because when we are flying and the dragon burst is procking a lot we have to keep pressing shift and it's not just a pain because sometimes you get stuck on the blocks so yeah we don't have a high enough speed yet he's on top of the mine so we're gonna go down to the bottom and we can just go ahead and keep flying up in mining i'm pretty sure it works pretty well because the mine just gets broken a lot faster boss is almost at 10k health so we are getting there to actually defeating the boss we also did get a vote party cake we might just after we kill the boss, we're going to go ahead and open that at spawn. Our main priority is just to kill this boss. It has so much health, honestly. So we just really want to kill it and get it over with. If you guys are enjoying prisons, make sure to join on the whitecloak.oplegends.com IP because it honestly just supports me a lot. It makes me continue making these videos. But personally, I'm having a lot of fun on the prisons. And I hope you guys are too because honestly, it's a bunch of fun. It's honestly really grindy. But I also really like that because you can't just AFK and sit around and do nothing and win. You actually have to put in the time, which honestly makes it worth it for everybody who is on the top 
top and the boss just died it looks like so we're definitely gonna take that we're getting the rewards pretty soon hopefully we get something good let's see what we got we got three million blocks of orbs or nine million i don't even know we got some blocks of orbs he got two or he got tier three booster box crate so i don't know those rewards are kind of all right probably not worth it for 40 million or 40 000 raw blocks but definitely gonna take any of the orbs that we can but now let's go to spawn and open up this cake because it could give us something good i don't really know but let's open it up hopefully it will give us a modifier and looks like we got two million blocks of orbs a beacon a tier one random ultimate multiplier multiplier let's go ahead and open up that looks like we got a beast master gives us two x bonus pet xp for one minute that's all right i still think the one we have is better but that's gonna be it for today's video i hope you guys did enjoy make sure to join on whitecloud.oplegends.com but that's gonna be it i'll see you in the next one peace out